Investigators say the break-in was just the start of this. Eventually, deputies found this guy hiding in the yard, claiming he was a confidential informant. He is now facing charges ranging from grand theft to animal cruelty. News 6's Lauren Cervantes is following the investigation. She joins us now live in Lake County. And Lauren, you spoke to the victim's friend who tried to confront this guy. I did, and her friend tells me the woman was afraid for her life and hiding in her closet when a man broke into her home claiming to be a law enforcement officer. She was hiding in the closet and she was scared for her life. Marshall Harbin says he received a message on Facebook from his friend asking for help. This after the Lake County Sheriff's Office says Jared Haney forced his way into the home and claimed to be a law enforcement officer. The guy was kicking in the door. He was stating that he was with the Lake County Sheriff's Office and that the homeowner victim had a warrant. Harbin says his friend was hiding and could hear someone inside her home. Her dogs were on a bed. She's in the closet and she can hear him shooting her dogs. You know, with it, luckily it was just a pellet gun. And when Harbin arrived, he says Haney was still at the home. When we got here, I came in through the front door and there was a dude in there with a backpack and baggy pants and, you know, and he's got a flashlight and a gun and he's waving it at me and get on the ground. Lake County search warrant. I said, show me a badge, bro. But Harbin says Haney didn't have a badge, and Harbin decided to follow Haney when he left the house. I started to take a chase to him. He shot at me twice, and that's when I found out it was a pellet gun. This is audio from a 911 call that came in. The guy with the gun was saying that he was a cop, but he definitely is not. But he's going, I'm a cop. I'm a cop. Backup's on the way. I said, backup? Backup's here, you know. Deputies say Haney was arrested and charged with home invasion with a firearm, animal cruelty, grand theft, and false impersonation of a law enforcement officer, among other charges. Friends of the victim tell me the dog who was shot at with the pellet gun is doing well. In Lake County, I'm Lauren Cervantes, getting results, News 6. Lauren, thank you.